Welcome to Calvin's Online Math. Let us look at this nice equation. Solve by completing the square x squared minus 6x plus 8. So the first thing is to make sure that the coefficient of x squared is 1. So in this case, that is right there. Then the next step is to move the constant term to the right hand side. So we have x squared minus 6x is equal to negative 8. The next thing to observe is that what we have on the left hand side is an incomplete square. So we have to complete it by introducing the missing component, which is C. And we use the relationship that C is given by half of B squared. So we're going to do that x squared minus 6x plus C, which will be half of B squared. And half of B will be negative 3. And you square that. And for balance, you do that to the uh, right hand side too. So minus 8 plus negative 3 squared. So the next thing is to take the perfect square on the left hand side by just considering root of x squared, which is just x, and root of the new c, which is just minus 3. And then you square that. And then you simplify what you have on the right hand side. So you have minus 8 plus negative 3 squared, which is 9. So it means you have x minus 3 raised to the power 2 is equal to 1. The next thing is just to get the square root of both sides. You'll have x minus 3 is equal to plus or minus 1. So that x is equal to 3 plus or minus 1. So the two solutions will be, the first one is x is equal to 3 plus 1, which is 4, and the second one will be x is equal to 3 minus 1, which is 2. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe.